Now, President Obama in North Carolina today, he is going to be trying to shore up African-American votes for Hillary Clinton. That was him, I believe, uh, either yesterday or a couple of days ago. Joining us now, though, Dallas Woodhouse, Executive Director of the North Carolina Republican Party. Dallas, straightforward question. Is the black vote key to winning your state? Well, I think all voters uh, are key, but what we are seeing in uh, North Carolina right now is a surge by uh, uh, Republican voters. Uh, I'll tell you just an interesting statistic, Stuart. Since 2012, uh, Republicans have improved their voter registration numbers uh, compared to Democrats by 140,000, thanks in large part to great work by the Republican Party, but especially the Republican National Committee. We've improved by 140,000 since four years ago. Yesterday, at the end of the last full day of early voting, Republicans were up 140,000 early votes compared to 2012. And Whoa. those things are directly Whoa. related, and our, our partners have done okay. a great job with that. Hold on a second. I've got to make sure I've got this right. As of yesterday, when you looked at early voting, that's people in by mail, and by going to the polling stations, right? That's what you got. Yes. You've got a, a, a surplus, 140,000 more Republicans than Democrats. That's accurate? No, no sir. No. Go. M more Democrats vote early, but of course about 20% of those Democrats vote for us. But compared to where we were in 2012, okay. Okay. an election that we won with Mitt Romney by 93,000 votes, 140,000 more Republicans have voted than in 2012, as opposed to the Democrats this year, which are flat and have actually okay. had a few, uh, a small number fewer okay. voters vote. So we have improved 140,000. They are absolutely flat. Got it. Uh, uh, they are losing the Obama coalition. Okay. The Obama what, coalition. Wait, wait a minute. Well, I've got one more thing. I've got to get this in. As I understand it, you, the GOP officers in North Carolina have been vandalized. We're looking at a wall painted up right there. Is the, this is the second time this has happened, isn't it? Well, we've actually had three or four incidents of vandalism. Now, I separate that from the horrific firebombing we had over in yeah. Hillsboro, uh, but that was an act of terrorism. We could have killed somebody, but we did have some uh, nasty sexist graffiti about Mr. Trump uh, and some other stuff on that building. Uh, spray paint, but you know, Republicans fix problems. Our governor, Pat McCrory, has fixed the economy here in North Carolina. Okay. We got over there last night, we cleaned it up, and we're getting out the vote today. All right, Dallas Woodhouse, thanks for joining us. Narrowing the gap there in North Carolina. Thank you, Dallas. Appreciate it.